Hi, I'm Donna from Nastasia.com. Today I'll be showing you how to crochet a special stitch called the Basic Tunisian Stitch, otherwise known as the Afghan Stitch. This stitch creates a nice, dense stitch that looks like a combination of knitting and crocheting. To do this stitch, you need a special crochet hook called an Afghan hook, and you need to know how to crochet a basic chain as well as single crochets. For the simple Tunisian stitch, I'll chain 15 stitches. Put your hook in the second chain from the hook and draw up a loop. Next, put your hook in the next chain and draw up another loop. Continue doing this for each of the remaining chains. Now that you have all of these loops on the hook, we'll now complete the stitch. Yarn over and draw through the first loop. Next, yarn over and draw through two loops. Yarn over and draw through the next two loops. Continue doing this until you have one loop remaining on the hook. For the next row, there are several variations on where to place your hook. However, I will show you one of the more popular approaches. Put your hook under the bar created by the previous row Yarn over and draw up a loop. Put your hook under the next bar. Yarn over and draw up a loop. Continue doing this for the remaining bars. Now, to complete the stitch, we'll do what we did previously. Yarn over and draw through the first loop. Next, yarn over and draw through two loops. Yarn over and draw through the next two loops. Continue doing this until you have one loop remaining on the hook. When you've reached the last row, you might want to have a nice finished edge. We'll create this by doing a modified slip stitch. To do this, put your hook under the bar created by the previous row. Yarn over and pull through both the bar and the loop on the hook. Next, put your hook under the bar Yarn over and pull through both the bar and the loop on the hook. Continue doing this until you have one loop remaining on the hook. I hope this video has helped you and please visit www.nastasia.com for more tips and tricks on creative, self-sufficient living.